know it's in Ezekiel 7. Ezekiel 7 and 16. I'll start at verse 14. They that they have blown the trumpet even to make all ready, but none goeth to the battle. For my wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. The sword is without, and the pestilence and the famine within. He that is in the field shall die with the sword, and he that is in the city, famine, pestilence shall devour him. Right, so it, destruction can happen in the city or in the wilderness. Salvation can happen in the city or in the wilderness. Okay? This is however the Most High has, has somebody set up. I ain't trying to tell anybody to go out to the wilderness. Okay? Because we know this whole place is just the wilderness in a nutshell. It says, But they that escape of them shall escape, and shall be on the mountains like doves of the valleys, all of them mourning, every one for his iniquity. All hands shall be feeble, and all knees shall be weak as waters. They shall also gird themselves with sackcloth, and horror shall cover them, and shame shall be upon all the faces, and baldness upon their heads. That's why, because of terrors that are going to be within. Destruction upon destruction. They shall cast their silver in the streets, and their gold shall be removed. Their silver and their gold shall not be able to deliver them in the day of the wrath of Yahweh. They shall not satisfy their souls, neither fear their bowels, because it is a stumbling block of their iniquity. That's right, man. They ain't going to be able to be satisfied with, with the, 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 the things that they're used to having here in America, man, or in the world. Okay? But yeah, that horror is coming, man. Great terror upon the earth. The king of terrors. They're going to be faced with the king of terrors. He's gonna bring forth the, the 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 wild beasts of the earth, you know. Like I was I was uh, I found out. Well, we already know the zoos. They carry lions. They carry tigers. What's gonna happen when everything starts happening? You know, everybody goes all out, man. Everybody goes out all out here in America. They're gonna there's gonna be some bugged out people. They're gonna let loose them animals, and they're gonna be roaming the earth. Or on this side of America, this side in the world, in America, they're going to be roaming out here hunting. Yeah, forget about that, man. The coyotes are going to attack. Because coyotes will attack you. You know? Packs of dogs. There's wolves. Mountain lions. You can't forget about them lions and them tigers that are in these zoos, man. They're going to be let loose. The Lord's gonna use them to, to, to hunt after you, uh, people, man. Eat your ass up. This is Ezekiel. Uh, Ezekiel 14 and 19 or if I send a pestilence unto that land and pour out my fury upon it in blood to cut off from it man and beast though Noah Daniel Job were in it as I live saith the Lord power they shall deliver neither son nor daughter they shall but deliver their own souls by their righteousness for thus saith the Lord power how much more when I send my, my four sword judgments upon Jerusalem, the sword, the famine, and the noisome beast, and the pestilence to cut off from it man and beast. See? This is Jeremiah 15 and 2, and it shall come to pass if they shall not, if they say unto thee, Whither shall we go forth? Then shalt thou tell them, Thus saith the Lord Power, such as, are, such as are for death to death, and such as are for the sword to the sword. 
and such as are for the famine to the famine, and such as are for the captivity to the captivity. And I will appoint over you them four kinds, saith the Lord, the sword to slay, the dogs to tear, and the fowls of heaven, and the beasts of the earth to devour and destroy. See? The Lord ain't no liar, man. What if some do not believe? Shall they make the, shall, shall they make the faith of the Most High without effect? God forbid. Don't believe me. Believe the word of Yahweh Bashem Al Washai, man. You know, knowing the terror of the Lord, we persuade men. But we know also that many are going to uh, forbear this. They're not going to gra gravitate to it. They're going to cast it away. He that hear, let him hear. And he that forbear, let him forbear. That's all we can do is come out, relay the message, tell you, be a, a, a light to the world. Hey, rest with us, man. Rest in Yahweh Bashem Al Washai. You know, come out of those graves and he's going to give you rest, bring you back to life by way of this word, man. So I'm going to end it with that. I hope y'all brothers were edified. You know, I want to give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh Shem Shai. Double honor to the elders of Great Millstone. Much love and respect to all you brothers out there doing the work of sincerity and truth. Till next time, I want to say Shalom.